So how are you marketing yourself here? This is a prime, prime tool for you to be able to toot your own horn and say anything you want to be able to say about yourself. Definitely take advantage of all that it has to offer. It allows you to upload your photo. It allows you to put in a little bit of information about your experience. Um, it can, you can put other things in there. Um, you know, any kind of affiliations you have, um, any kind of designations you have. Also, most importantly, what your experience level is. And even something as simple as being a rural agent, and even if you don't have a lot of experience, but you've done REO before and you're willing, you put that in there. Just say something as simple as, you know, have worked with REO, understand the challenges, um, I'm willing to take assignments. Maybe something as simple as that lets us know, wow, that person's out there. They're, you know, I'm going to give them a call because they're willing to do something with us. Um, they're, they're wanting some REO assignments. And even if I have to do some training, I know that that person's alive and, and taking it wanting to do this. And when, I, when there's only a couple of choices, I mean, having somebody like that is, you know, a lifesaver for us. And if you're in a metro area or medium metro area, setting yourself apart by saying something like, you know, I have Fannie Mae experience or, um, you know, I've done certain certifications, I have a lot of equator experience, it will catch our eye. And it does kind of give us an indicator that, okay, this person has taken the time, they specialize in REO or they do a lot of REO and they're willing to, um, you know, kind of, learn what they need to do and, and meet all the challenges and, and they're wanting something right now. So use that, use that space, use it wisely. I would, um, I would advise against being gimmicky here um, only because when we're doing that quick vetting, the first impression, you know, that's so important. You never get a second chance on making a first impression. So if you put a caricature of yourself as goofy or you write something silly or there's misspellings or it doesn't make any sense, it, it, when we're just like speed reading down those profiles, it's kind of a little bit of a turn off. So you don't want anything to turn anybody off on your on this profile data area.